Welcome back to my channel and today is a video. I'm about to get into the nitty gritty, okay? I'm about to tell you guys all of my personal tips on how to smell good all day. I'm about to get y'all all the products, everything that you need, okay? Hygiene products and tips. So if you guys are interested, stay tuned and let's hop right into the video. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to hop into my tips. Tip number one is when you're using perfume or lotion, try to match the fragrances if that's making sense. So like this, and this is an example. Match the warm and cozy lotion with the warm and cozy perfume. Okay, like this just makes sense. So whenever you buy stuff, like if you go to Bath and Body Works, Victoria's Secret, maybe even Walmart, try to get the perfume that matches the lotion or the soap that matches the lotion or the soap that matches the perfume. You get what I'm saying? Because it just gives you a long lasting smell and the smell will get more into your skin. You know what I'm saying? So it'll actually stick and stay. Okay, so let's get into the next tip. Next tip is when you're spraying on perfume, any type of perfume, y'all, it could be like, I have all my stuff laid out here, but it could be like some type of hot, ooh, <laughs> almost dropped the perfume, y'all. Then it could be high end perfume, like this is Marc Jacobs, y'all. This smells so, so, so good. I need to do like a fragrance video just strictly for those type. But y'all, whenever you're spraying that, it is important to apply oil to your skin first when you're spraying your perfume. So like, I just say like if you wanna if you want it to really really stick on your neck put on some oil and yeah y'all and then it'll stick and then spray it right there so the smell will last like all day this is a product that i use we're gonna now get into the products this is the product that i use it's so 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 good y'all smells good um it's cocoa butter radiant body oil by vaseline of course um another oil that i use is honey oil now this is just i just like how it smells in the I like how it feels. This is from Victoria's Secret though. Well, pink, if you want to get technical. Keeping your skin moisturized is just like basic hygiene, one one Like every time you get off the tub or the shower, of course, moisturize your body. Get something that works for you. I have another product here that I use, which is Aquaphora. This is Teal and Ointment. This is for the girls who have dry skin, y'all. This works wonders. It actually is for everything, like cracked, irritated skin. Um, I know it's like an ointment. Technically, you could put it on cuts and scrapes, burns, lips, and everything. So, y'all, yes, I really recommend Aquaphor. So, yeah, that's another tip. Keep your body moisturized. I already told y'all about the oils. Now, we're about to get into some of my favorite products and how I use these products. And yeah, one product that I really, really love and I'm always recommend and vouch for is coconut oil, virgin coconut oil, pressed coconut oil. You can use this in so many ways. I'm just go down the list. For one, it's a good moisturizer. For two, it's good for um, shaving. You can actually shave with this if you like. It'll leave your skin so smooth, so soft. Three, you can use this for um, ingrown hairs, ingrown bumps, if you have ingrowns down there. <laughs> this will clear this right up, y'all. Like, so quick, I always tell people, coconut oil is the way to go. So yes, it also can be used as a good makeup remover too. At this point, coconut oil did just go ahead and sponsor me. So let's get into the next product. The next product is this lotion, y'all. This lotion smells so, so, so good. This is the, um, this is the coconut miracle oil moisturized coconut oil it just smells really good it's a vanilla type of smell so like i said y'all always match your lotions and everything um me personally i love vanilla type of smells so that's mostly what you're gonna see me have so let's get into another one of their products i'm about to show you the soap that i use this right here is by far my favorite soap from them this is the soft shea this is the shea soft and smooth body wash um, I don't know. It says this. I don't know aroma. I'm gonna just put it to the camera so I can see. But this right here, y'all, it'll leave you smelling like I'm telling you, like it just it smells so good. Always, like I said, try to match. Now this is not the exact same as this, but it is the same product. If you get what I'm saying, um, yeah. So, like I said, always try to match the best of your abilities with the lotion and the soap sprays all of that you get the idea but yes y'all this smells so so good now another thing that i do um as far as tips i always exfoliate my skin now you can exfoliate your skin by using a glove i'm gonna show you the glove so i often use this pink glove y'all it's like a scrub so you put it on while you're in the shower in the tub if it's on your hand y'all it's kind of wet on my bad 
so I'm not gonna put it on my hand, but you get the idea. Put it on your hand, rub it all over your body, get all the dead skin, smooth out your dead skin still, so you can feel nice and clean, gets all that dirt off, yeah. So that's another thing that helps me. It just like goes hand in hand with my bath routine slash shower routine. Now, another thing that you can use to exfoliate is, I don't know, I guess it got the soap on it, is um, this sugar scrub, y'all. I love sugar scrub. This is Tree Hood. They're a good brand. I recommend them. Um, yeah, so that's basically all the things that I use as far as products to let my skin feel like really soft and exfoliated. Also, y'all, another body wash that I love is Johnson Skin. Um, Johnson Skin Nourish Moisture Wash. And the scent is vanilla and oats. Like I said, y'all, I love vanilla. So it just smells so good. And even though this is for babies, it still leaves your skin soft and you know it won't be harmful, especially if you have sensitive skin. As far as shaving, I use Nair. Um, I don't feel like pulling it out now, but I'm gonna just pop up a picture of it on the screen. And also I used to get waxes. So yeah, it just depends on what you like as far as that. Um, now, since we're already on the topic of waxing and shaving, let's talk about soaps for your your hello kitty okay um let's get into what i use as far as that now i was using honey pot's foaming wash it was for sensitive skin um, it was so perfect for me because my skin was sensitive but y'all i don't know if they discontinued a certain version of it if you know you know but i'm gonna pop it up on the screen i recently ran out i'm gonna have to go back to the store and get some more but that is a great product for your hoo-ha um now let's get into the deodorants the odor that I use is Lady Speed Stick. Love it. Use the scent Powder Fresh. That's what it is. Um, I like powdery smells. Like I said, powdery vanilla smells. It just, it just does it for me, you know. And yeah, y'all. Um, I have so much perfumes and lotions that I could show y'all, but just know, rack up on the vanilla scents. And if you're not a vanilla type of girl, go fruity, spring, like bubblegum type scents too but you don't really need all of this i'm just giving you guys my personal tips on how to smell the best and also what i use too um a, just a regular basic soap that i use that goes a long way is pink dove i was i would show y'all but <laughs> y'all it's almost gone but i'm gonna just pop it up on the screen pink dove is the best dove don't argue with me argue with yourself because it smells the best and I love it, y'all. Also, guys, another great, great tip for hygiene overall is just to drink of water. That will have you feeling better, smelling better. Like, water is the way to go. Also, take your vitamins, you know, things like that. But, yeah, I feel like that will conclude this video. If you need more tips, let me know. Comment down below. Um, yeah, guys, I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned.